Hi everyone, welcome to science tutorial for you and in this video I'm going to do a test on uh, balancing chemical equations. Before doing the test it's better for you to give a pause and then try these questions and after you have finished I will provide you the answers. So if you want to pause it now please do so. Okay, here we go. Question number one, define balanced chemical equation. Number of atoms on the reactant side is equal to the number of atoms on the product side. Or you could say the number of atoms on the left hand side is equal to the number of atoms on the right hand side of a chemical reaction. So it's one out of one. Well done. Question number two, find the number of atoms in three molecules of H2SO4. So you have to tell me how many hydrogen do you have over here. So it's two times, three, so it's six molecules. Sulfur, three times, sulfur molecules. So it's three molecules, three atoms of sulfur. Um, you got four oxygen, but three molecules of H2SO4 are going to bring us 12 molecules. Okay, so it's three out of three. Okay. Now B part, two molecules of calcium carbonate. So this is this is two atoms, um, two carbon, but one molecule of calcium carbonate has three oxygen, so two molecules of calcium carbonate will have six oxygen atom. So it's three out of three. Well done. Question number three, balance this equation. Now, sodium and oxygen is giving us sodium oxide. You have two atoms of oxygen and one over here. So what do you do? Put a big two over here. So it's giving us two atoms of oxygen and we got two over here. That's nicely balanced. Now, how many sodium do you have over here? Without the two over here is two, but with the two moles, is bringing us to four atoms of sodium. So we put four over here. It's two out of two. Okay, good. Balance this equation. This is um, combustion reaction. We have fuel, which is this fuel is ethene. And it's reacting with oxygen. When a fuel reacts with oxygen, it will always give you carbon dioxide and water. Please remember this, it's very important. Balancing a combustion reaction is a bit tricky. So what you have to do, leave the oxygen out. Do the oxygen as last. Okay. This is the way to do it. You got two carbon and one carbon over here. So you put two over here. So four hydrogen, you got two hydrogen over here. So you put two over here. Now you count the number of oxygen on the product side over here how many oxygen you have you have two how many oxygen do you have you have this and this so that's four which gives us six so we have six oxygen on the product side but on the reactant side you have two so to make it six you put a big three now this is how you balance it okay so this is 3 out of 3. Everything add up to 12 marks. Please provide your score on the commenting box. And please subscribe and share it with your friend. And I'll see you guys in my next video.